What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Dio aka Bonds Urban Tech Reviews and we got a new little product that I just found in the store today when I was out shopping with my wife so I wanted to you know what I mean cop that thing bring it to the channel and see what it's about so you see right here we have the Evo VR virtual reality headset for your smartphone it says play watch explore enter the world of 360 degrees virtual reality it's called the Evo next and it says it works with all smartphones so before we get into that let me bust out the tablet show you where you can cop that thing at let me let me turn down the screen all right so you could cop it at Toys R Us right here for 14 99 now that's not where I got it from I did not get it from Toys R Us so you see right here it's Toys R Us 14.99 I got it from my local Walmart for $15 uh, it might have been yeah I think it was 14.99 I got it from my local Walmart for $14.99 same price just different location I actually searched the Walmart website I could not find the product so I end up doing a Google search and I end up finding it there on uh, Toys R Us and a couple other places. But you can get it at Toys R Us, Best Buy, I think Amazon has it, and uh, a couple other spots. But just Google it, you know what I mean, and you'll be able to uh, see. So we're going to check out the box. You see it says Play, Watch, Explore. We already went over the front side of the box. Uh, the top of the box says Evo uh, VR, Play, Watch, Explore. And this is the other side of the box that says Unleash virtual reality right from your smartphone um journey to exotic cities game across the galaxy rock out at live concerts enjoy your own movie theater um it says slide your smartphone into the headset and let the adventures begin dive into a three-dimensional interactive game your own home theater or across the globe to explore destinations Lightweight or surprisingly comfortable, the Evo VR headset provides you with hours of uninterrupted escape. So, I'm going to check out the back of the box. Uh, Evo branding all over it, which, you know, you should expect. Um, virtual reality headset for your smartphone. It says play, play VR games, watch movies, and explore destinations. Works with all smartphones, or all iPhones, my bad, and all Samsung Galaxy phones, and more. 360 degrees panoramic experience, lightweight design, extra soft cushioning, full adjustable and removable headband, thousands of VR apps available in your app store, including Google Cardboard, supports left, right, 3, 3D and augmented uh, reality, immersive 90 degree field of view. So right here, that's kind of a, a look at what it looks like. Y'all see that? It says fits all smartphones up to six inches. So if there's any smartphones on the market bigger than six inches, you ain't gonna be able to get that joint in there. Uh, <laughs> um, download mind blowing apps from your app store. Simply slide your smartphone into the viewer, strap in, and choose your adventure. Now, <clears throat> says contents is you get the Evo Next VR headset, removable headband, and a lens cloth. Specifications fits phone sizes 3.5 inches to 6 inches, adjustable for look for facial distance and pupil distance, 42 millimeter optical lens, field of view 90 degrees, weight 15.8 ounces, support for iOS and Android. So you could download at the App Store, or you could download Google Play, and it says Google Cardboard compatible, compatible smartphone required. So, we done went over the box. I'm not going to get into what's at the bottom because this ain't much. But we got a new unboxing knife on the channel. You know what I mean? I try to try to stay up on them. I know, you know, this might look like a, a normal shotgun shell. And I just dropped that thing. That would have, boom. But uh, firepower, 20 gauge, you know what I mean? Shotgun shell. But we popped that thing open like that. And it's a knife. So, we got the new knife. 
and we just gonna make this real easy on ourselves and pop it open like that see if it just slides open slide out the, the case did I miss some tape somewhere I think there's tape at the bottom hindering the process all right so here we go with the, the bullet knife I'm gonna keep that over there and we slide it out the first casing then you got a red box Evo VR play watch explore same thing on the back and, uh, let's see See what we got in this joint. All right, we got the cloth. Nothing else in the box. Throw that box to the back, and we got. This is made by Mercury Innovations. Okay. So let's see what this $15 headset looks like. Okay, so it comes with the strap already, strapped up. Which I like, you know what I mean? Because that Gear VR, you had to uh, put the strap together. Nothing else in there. Put that in the box. And this is what it looks like, folks. Evo VR. Pretty lightweight, not heavy at all. Uh, has a different look, you know what I mean, than the uh, Gear VR. Uh, we got some plastic over the lens on that one. Plastic over the lens right there. Now, the main reason I bought this was because my kids love my Gear VR. You know what I mean? But being that I only have the S7 Edge, you know what I mean? I actually thought about buying a Note 5 or something just so they could use the, uh, the Gear VR. But then I come across this. And I really couldn't, you know what I mean, pass it up, at least trying it out, you know, because my kids have smartphones, uh, iPhones, so they could use it in here. And I have to use my Note 7, I mean my uh, S7 Edge. So, I mean, this is a nice little back plate. Uh, see, it's flexible, but it's really hard, like hard plastic, maybe hard rubber. Um... I don't know how comfortable this is going to be on your head, but you know we'll find that out. Um, it's real similar to a Gear VR, you know what I mean, just with the, the lens part. Um, got some buttons at the top. So you can slide that over. Got some buttons at the top. Uh, they go left and right, so. Oh, uh, alright, so I'll see what they do. So. See how they move the lens? Yeah, I mean, left, right, left, right. Okay. So, all right, this is how you slide your device in. So you pull it out like that. You can see inside a little bit. Clear to the other side. See my fingers? Spare fingers. All right. So, all right, that's what we got so far. So, I'm gonna look at the book because I know there's an app you're gonna have to download. So let me find out what the app is so I can download them. Uh, I didn't think they would tell you that straight off the top. So, all right, I busted out two phones today so I can show you how it works on the iOS device, how it works on the Android device. So this is my my wife's gold S7 Edge. Uh, let me find her Play Store and let me go to Evo VR. See if it pops up. That says for car box or what's it called? Yeah, car box. Um, all right, so let me try to find this app. Uh, 
Okay, now you would think that they would have the app. It says, on your smartphone, launch your app store, search for and download VR apps to use. But like, what VR apps are you supposed to use? All right, so I'm just going to search VR apps, see if I can come up with something. VR apps. All right, so we're just going to go VR roller coaster. We're going to download the VR roller coaster on even with this. I'll do a later video to show you how to do it with the, uh, show you how to do it with an iOS device, because I don't want to sit here and, and, you know, take all this time doing this. All right, so what we're going to do is, I guess we're going to try to slide the device in. Uh, I can't even tell you which way it goes, but, uh. Let's try. All right, so I got a little, a little thing right here. I guess we can make it wider for your device. You slide it in like that. All right, and you take. Make sure I'm holding that right. Slide it in. That would be wrong. Maybe I put it in backwards. Because if it goes in that way, I mean the screen will have to go the opposite way. Alright, so slide it in and it just turned off. I hate that. Now see it's on the power button, which means it's just gonna keep turning off. Alright, so let's slide the phone in there. I wonder if you gotta start the app or or what? It seems like it's still on the, the home screen. All right, so let's go to VR roller coaster. Okay. Okay, so let me check this out, see what it's about. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay. Oh. Now this is decent. This is nice. I mean, for... for the price that you pay for this, I mean, you can't beat that. You can't beat it. Okay. So, I mean, it's not bad. It's, it's actually not bad. Well, let me, I think I had it in upside down. So let me flip the phone over. Now the volume's all the way down. This this is I don't know about the design, cause like it's it's like hitting all the buttons. It's turning down the phone, turning off the phone. So I, I'm not I'm not a hundred percent sure on the buttons. You know what I mean? Cause every time you you know what I mean turn it on, then it's turning down the volume. 
you see I'm trying to power off the device but let me turn it back on real quick uh we'll go roller coaster two this time you see this is what you be saying Like I said, it's, it's not bad at all. I mean, for 15 bucks, I, I'm not going to knock it. I'm definitely not going to knock it. You know, so. Try it back on again. I mean, this this is pretty decent. This is pretty decent. I mean, it reminds me of a VR, a Gear VR. You know, I mean, it, it feels good. That uh, little rubber strap or plate that I said was on the back feels good. It don't feel too hard. Don't hurt you. Um, this is really realistic. You know what I mean? So. I think I think this is a uh, a definitely go buy. I think it's a, a a buying product. You gotta grab one of these, especially you know what I mean for fourteen dollars. This is you know what I mean a lot cheaper than the VR, the Gear VRs when they came out. You know what I mean. So if you get one of these, let me try to turn the camera around so y'all can. I mean, kind of see me. Yeah, but like I said, I mean, this is decent. It's, it's really nice. Uh, the worst part to me, I think, would be the, the design just because the worst part would be the design because you don't, you know, I mean, you can't. Uh, Put it in in the case in this little slide case without hitting the power button. You know what I mean? See, it just turned off by itself just doing that. So, I mean, that's a flaw. That you know what I mean, but it's, it, for 15 bucks, I mean, you live with that. You live with that. Now, maybe with this, it would be a little different because let's see, it would be a little different because look. You know, it's a smaller phone, so you might not have that problem, you know, but definitely with the S7 Edge, probably with bigger phones, you're going to have that problem with the button placement of it, hitting the power button and turning the power button off, you know, but like I said, um, all in all for 15 bucks, I know this video went a little longer than I really wanted it to go, but, um, uh, I mean, 15 bucks you can't beat it i mean there's no buttons on the outside like the gear vr there's no buttons um so you you can't you know there's no menu or anything so all you basically do is you download the game you uh start the game and then you uh you know slide it in i guess you know and, and play it now it says on your smartphone launch the app store search for and download VR apps to use. Slide out the front tray of your Evo VR headset. Install the three mini rubber bumper pads into the tray to protect your phone. I don't know where the hell that is. Mini bumper pads. I don't know. To uh, protect your phone, launch your app or game. Place your phone in the tray, making sure they align the center of the phone screen with the headset's uh, mid -set point, midpoint mark. Slide the phone back into the headset tray. Adjust uh, the popularity for focal distance by moving. We did all that. Connect your wired or Bluetooth headset device for optimal, 
optical experience. Enjoy. Um, like I said, so I mean, I can't be mad at this. You know, I can't be mad at this. For Fifteen bucks, my kids are gonna love it. You know, what I mean, they're gonna love it. So, um, can this compare with the Gear VR? Sure. Uh, you know, for children. You know what I mean? For children and some adults, this, this would be sufficient. The Gear VR has a lot more, better experience as far as, you know, having a menu, you know, and stuff like that. If you can watch YouTube on here and watch, you know, get on the internet, which you probably couldn't because there's no dedicated buttons on here. There's no dedicated buttons like on the Gear VR where you can push the button on the side where there's a, you know, a select button up and down, you know what I mean? Volume, you can't do that. So this is limited, but like I said, for the price... What do you expect for the price? You gotta say this is good. You know it's decent. They give you a decent VR experience. If you never experienced that VR, this will give you a decent VR experience. This will definitely give you a good VR experience. So it's your boy Doak Bonds. You enjoyed this video? Click that thumbs up. Uh, if you're not subscribed to the channel, definitely subscribe to the channel. Easy to do that by clicking the little Android guy in, in the bottom right hand corner. If you're not following me on all my social media sites, Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, everywhere, you want to be like Visa, baby. Don't cheat yourself. Treat yourself. Definitely holla at your boy. Catch you on the next video. We out. Deuces.